Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today it's a baby name video and I'm so excited so let's just jump right into it. The first name I have is Alegria and Alegria is absolutely stunning. I met a girl recently named Alegria and I just loved it. Loved her personality, loved the, the sound and the spelling the way it is. It's stunning. I just love it. I think it's so pretty and I think she mentioned that it means sun in Spanish, like the sunshine. So if I am wrong, please correct me, but I really love this name. The next name I have is Aurelia and Aurelia is one of those names where it is just familiar but unique. We've heard so many Leah with Leah endings and I think it's stunning, but Aurelia, it just gives that more unique flair to it, which I really, really love. The next name I have is Arla, and I love Arla. I think that it is so stunning. It gives me Carla vibes, but it also gives me Arlo vibes, which I feel like it's more like the boy version of Arlo, if that makes sense. And I just love Arla. I think it is so pretty. The next name I have is Davina, and Davina is a girl from Selling Sunset. She was one of the workers on there. And I when, I when I heard that name, I was like, okay, that is unique. Now, my issue with it is, first of all, it's a D name. My dog is the D name, so I would never be able to use the D name, I think. But the fact that it has, like, Dave in it or Davina, like, it just gives me Dave vibes, which is, like, such a boy name. And I don't know. It's, like, is it is it, like, very masculine energy? I feel like it's very masculine energy. The next time I have is East. And East is so cute. I think that this is so unique and so rare. I would spell it E-C-E -E and East. I think that a lot of people would have trouble pronouncing it, but I think it is so cool. The next name I have is Adnan and Adnan is one of those names that is just stunning. I love the way that it is. I love that it's unique. I love that we haven't heard it a ton before. So this is a very, very top one on my list. The next name I have is Baker, and Baker is one of those last name turn first names, which I love. I think it's so cute. I just, I, I love the vibe of Baker. I think it is just such a cute name. The next name I have is Tarek, and Tarek is a name um, of a partner from one of the girls on Selling Sunset. So I got a few names from there a long time ago when I watched the show and they just kind of made it down to the bottom of my list. So you might be hearing a few of those. The next name I have on my list is Karamo. And Karamo, I do not know where I heard this from. Like I said, this is the bottom of my list and I have no clue where half these names are from. But Karamo is interesting. That is unique. If you are brave, girl, do that because that is a really cool name. The next name I have is Kayo, and Kayo is stunning. I love Kai. I love Kayo. I think it's so pretty. I think it's such a unique way to do Kai, and I think Kai is stunning, but I think it's very, very um, played out, if you will. But Kayo is so cool. I absolutely love this name. The next name I have is Karan, and Karan is one of those names where it's like, oh, is that too close to the name of the religious book for uh, religious Muslims, um, the Quran? I, I think Karan is really cute, but it might be a little bit close for you. So if you're into that, I think that that could be really cute. And if you're into religious names, that could also be a really good one. The next name I have is Simu, and Simu I'm sure came from a person, I wouldn't have made this one up, but I cannot exactly remember where. So if you guys know where Simu is from, please let me know in the comments, I cannot remember. The next name I have is Odyssey, and Odyssey is so cool. It is definitely something that we've heard before, but not super um, common pretty unique, pretty rare. I love Odyssey. I think it is so pretty. Now, in addition to Odyssey, I think Odessa is stunning. I love Odessa. I love Ames names that end in A, and I just, I think Odessa is beautiful. The next name I have is Nija, and Nija is amazing. I think Nija is stunning. It gives me the best vibe when I say it. I just love Nija so much, but I know that my boyfriend isn't into it, so it definitely isn't on my list, but if it is on your list, please tell me because I'm obsessed with this and I just want to be like jealous from afar. Um, the next name I have is Agatha, 
and Agatha is so cute. I feel like we've heard this one before, obviously, but it's just old-fashioned and I feel like we need the kind of a reminder, a refresher that it's there. It's still a name. It's still an option and I think it's really cool, Agatha. The next thing I have is Vara and Vara is so cute. I love this name. We've seen a lot of Vidas recently and I think Vara is so cute. I just love this. The next name I have is Vera, and if you want to be a confused parent and have twins, name them Vara and Vera. Um, it's probably a little close, too close to com in comfort for me, but I think Vera is stunning. We have Vera Wang, of course, so it's definitely something that we've heard, but just just something to keep in mind. The next name I have is Araceli, and Araceli is a name that I heard on TV and I cannot remember where. So please, if you know, tell me in the comments because you guys always seem to help me out with that. So Araceli, I love this. I think that it is so unique. It's very cool. I just, I love this name. The next name I have is Aster. And Aster is, I, I think we've heard this a few times before, but I still think that it is quite rare. I don't hear it quite often, but I just think Aster is so cool. I really love this name. The next name I have is Deja and i love deja i think ugh, i love the i love the name vu i think vu is pretty and deja vu obviously like could you imagine naming your kid that no i couldn't but i love using vu as a middle name and i think deja is so freaking cute i'm obsessed with this obviously i'd spell it different but i love it the next name i have is hasani and hasani is it gives me ethnic vibes it gives me Definitely not traditional name, but very, very cool name as well. The next name I have is Wiley, and Wiley is so cute. I love this name. I think that we've heard Wilder or Wild so many times now. I am definitely over that name at this point. I think it is a stunning name, but I could never go for something that popular. And Wiley is such a cool, like, kind of common one i love this i think wiley is awesome the next name i have is ayana and ayana comes from love is blind i know that one and they called her yanni on there and i thought that was so cute i love that i love the nickname i just i think everything about that name is is amazing the next name i have is harlan and harlan is so freaking cute i feel like we've heard it before but again it's one of those ones i don't hear often so just want to bring that to your attention because it's such a cute one to miss the next name i have is harlem and harlem is a friend of mine her daughter is named harlem and i love this name i think it's so cute i love place names i think it's just such a cool name um but yeah i think it's one of those names that we might not we might not hear so often so we just forget about and i think this is a stunning name the next name i have is weston and weston came from the last name of michael weston on burn notice if you guys have ever watched burn notice this is like one of my top favorite shows and michael weston was the main character and weston is such a cool first name such a cool first name the next name i have is axe and Axe is so cute. I love this. I think it's such a cool name for a boy. I definitely am not feeling it for a girl as much, but this is such a powerful name. I love it. The next thing I have is Lydia. And Lydia is, I'm sorry, it's not Lydia, it's Lida. Whoa, my bad. The next thing I have is Lida. I was gonna say Lida, Lydia is very common. Lida is so cute. It is similar to Lydia. It gives me Lydia vibes, but Lida is amazing. I love this name. I think it is so pretty, stunning. The next name I have is Lisette, and Lisette is the name of a YouTuber that I follow, and I thought that that was such a cute name. I just love that name, and I've never heard it before, so I said throwing it on the list. The next name I have is Adley or um, yeah, Adley, there's two spellings, that's what I said or for, so you guys will see the spellings down below as always, and Adley is so cute, I love this, definitely have heard it before, but definitely want to keep that in mind when we are choosing, there are names that we forget all the time. The next name I have is Affie, Affie, 
And Afi is one of those names where it's like, oh, is that cute? Ugh. I think you need to hear that one much more. So if you're into that, you could probably say it your whole pregnancy and by the end of your pregnancy, decide if that's one of your top contenders. But I think Afi is very cute. I just don't think that we hear it enough. So I definitely think if you say it throughout your whole pregnancy and if you're really, really into it by the end, definitely use it. The next name I have is Alethea. And Alethea is such a unique but also kind of common name but we don't see it that often and I just love this name I I just had to put it on the list I think Alethea is so pretty the next name I have is Arlen but spelled A-R-L-Y-N-N -N for a girl and my friend has a son named Arlen and I love this for a girl I think that this is stunning I love it for a boy but definitely spelled different for a boy, but I love Arlen for a girl. I think this is so pretty. The next name I have is Avia, and Avia is so pretty. I love this name. It's unique but familiar. I love names that start with A and end with A. So stunning. And it's very hard to do unique names like that, and I think that one's very unique. The next name I have is Beatrice, and Beatrice is such a cute name I'm sure you've all heard it before I love the nickname Trixie but it's one of those ones where I think we don't hear it enough and then we forget about it so I just wanted to remind you Beatrix is stunning the next name I have is Beck and Beck comes from you the main character her last name was Beck or something that was shortened to Beck and that's what everyone called her I love this for a boy I love this for a girl I think that it is so cute the next name I have is Stone, and I think you guys are probably like, wait, is that even cute? Yeah, you know what? I think Stone is really cute. I just, I love that. Could you see like Axe and Stone as like brothers? That would be so cute. I love that. The next name I have is Clea, and Clea is the name of the girl on home, the home edit, and I am obsessed with this name. It's obviously like you could use Cleopatra and have it short as Clea, but I think Clea as just the name is stunning. I love Clea, it's one of my top. The next name I have is Crosby and Crosby is kind of another last name turned first name. We have, um, uh, why am I blanking on the name, sorry. Uh, there is a player on the P Pittsburgh Penguins. His last name is Crosby. I can't think of his first name. Guys, don't kill me. Tell me in the comments because I'm having a total brain melt right now the next name i have is elowen and elowen is stunning it gives me old-fashioned vibes unique rare i love this i think this is so classic the next name i have is fern and i love fern we love ferns my boyfriend and i he loves plants i think that it is such a cute plant name i think i would like it more for a middle name i don't know why i'm just not a huge fan of f names as a first name but I still really love this name. The next name I have is Hollis, and Hollis is so cute. I'm sure we've heard it a ton as a last name, and I just love last names as first names. I think Hollis is such a cute boy name. The next name I have is Juno, and I love Juno. I am sure that we've heard it before, but I just think it is so pretty, and I, if I'm right, there is a place called Juno, Alaska. There's like a city in, in Alaska called Juno. Correct me if I'm wrong, I think Juno is so pretty though. In addition to Juno, I love Juna. I think Juna is very pretty. We see June often, but I think Juna is one of those ones that's very overlooked and very stunning. The next name I have is Malone, and Malone is so cute. I love this name. Obviously we know who Post Malone is, but I just think Malone is such a cute name. The next name I have is Monroe, and I love Monroe. We have Marilyn Monroe. It's a last name turned first name type of deal, and it's just so stunning. The next name I have is Tatum, and Tatum is another last name turned first name, obviously Channing Tatum, but that is also another stunning name. I love this for a boy. The next name I have is Aniston, and as Jennifer Aniston, yes, I love this. Also stunning, very unique. I don't think that I've ever heard of a person named Aniston. The next name I have is Nola, and Nola is so cute. I love this. It's such a cute little girl name. I'm really into this. 
The next name I have is Rhea, and Rhea is also stunning. I love this name. I love how it's spelled. You can spell it differently, R-A-Y-A, R-H-E-A. I love the options, just such a cute name. The next name I have is Rowey, and Rowey is one of those names where you're like, oh, is that cute? I love it. I could see like River and Rowey. I just think that's so cute, and you can obviously use Row as a nickname, but I think Rowey is so cute. The next name I have is Sawyer, and Sawyer is stunning. I think that we've all heard Sawyer quite often. It's like, it's getting very, very popular right now, but I just love this name. I think it is such a stunning name. The next name I have is Savea, and Savea is so stunning. Now, this wouldn't really work in Hebrew because it would probably not work as a translation because it kind of means like full, um, like you're full of food. But Savea is in like just without the meaning in Hebrew. I love this. I think that this is stunning and it looks amazing on paper as well. The last and final name I have for you guys is Tallulah. And Tallulah was top on my name top of my name list for a very long time but my boyfriend has made it very clear that there will never be a child for us named Tallulah so please go ahead and name your child Tallulah in honor of me if you do comment down below and tell me I'm just joking don't do that because of me um yeah so thank you guys again so much for watching I really 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 appreciate it you guys don't know how much it means to me until you watch the end it means so much if you guys really like this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below, and comment telling me what was your favorite name. I would love to know. So I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.